Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am so excited to be back here again. Uh, the meal of the week is spicy mashed potatoes and chicken hearts. Let's look into it. So guys, for our ingredients, we have this as our ingredients. Um, I'll use some for the chicken hearts and some for only the mesh i also have garlic which i'm going to use for the chicken hearts and i have this spice meat masala it's from woolworths and i have a black pepper sauce um i'll use it on the chicken hearts also and then we have this combo we have butter and milk we all know it goes together so it's a salted butter i'm gonna use it on the mesh and also the milk i'm gonna use it on the mesh also so i'll also put in some vegetables on the mesh and yeah on the mesh only yes so i am first going to cut my potatoes I'm going to dice them and then after that I'll put them in the water and wash them and then I'm going to start boiling them. So now I'm going to pour in some salt before the water starts boiling with the tomatoes and yep. Um, now that the water has started boiling, I'll put in my ingredients, not all of them, but I'll just put this. And yeah, I've already used salt, so I'm just gonna go with this. And also my vegetables, because they need to boil a little. And yeah. Okay, before I start with the chicken hearts, um, I just want to explain why I put the spice at an earlier stage in the potatoes. It is because um, spice needs to sink in to the, uh, the potatoes. And another reason is because I've used a curry and I need the curry to do its work. I need it to change the color of the, to enhance the color of the potatoes. So I put it um, just when the water starts boiling. Okay, excuse me guys for not showing my face, but it's because I don't have enough space in the kitchen. But now I'm going to start with the chicken hearts and I'm gonna pour some cooking oil. Not too much, just a little. And after that, I'm gonna fry my onions and put some curry. Okay, let's go and put in some chicken hearts. Okay guys, 
So when the water in the potatoes start getting thicker, you can now go in with your butter and also your milk. You don't have to put a lot of milk, just a little. And then let it boil for like five minutes. And then after that, you are going to mash your potato. Okay, so now I want to put more focus on the chicken hearts because I was a little bit busy with the potato. Now we're going to focus on the chicken. Um, I've already started cooking or frying the chicken hearts. Now I need to go in with my spice and we are good to go. Okay, as we can see, my potatoes look a little bit light. But after mashing and leaving the pot here for like 10 minutes, it's gonna become harder. And I'll just start dishing up. Okay guys, so I don't usually use this, but I want to try it on the chicken heart. And after this, I'm going to go in with this black pepper sauce. I hope you see it. Yeah. We are almost done. Okay guys, we are done and we are ready to dig in. I'm gonna start dishing up for my visitors and yeah, just stay tuned. Mm. Yeah. That sounds sensational. <laughs> Sensational.